Remember when we bought this together at Logan's last year? You had to have the perfect outfit for your first day at Landview High. Oh, it was such a fun day. That was such a dream come true for me. Shopping with my sister. Star? I don't want to go. I mean, I care about Russ, but I don't want to move all the way to Tahiti. I wish that there was something we could do to change it, but my daddy... I tried everything. I even went to Aunt Vicky for help. You are a sight for sore eyes. Well, I don't believe this. How long has it been? Oh, too long, Chuckles. Much too long. <laughs> I know that Dad did everything to keep me here. <laughs> he loves you so, so much. You know, when Ross... Um, first showed up with my mom's will, saying that he was supposed to get custody of me. I, I don't know, it didn't, didn't really sink in what it meant. You know, I didn't really get it. And now I do. It means going back to paradise. Waking up to these amazing sunrises. And going swimming in the ocean every day. Catching fish for dinner. Sounds, um... It sounds incredible. It is. I would trade all of it in a heartbeat if it meant that I could stay here and wake up each day close to my family and my friends. I mean a little D. I don't want you going to Cherryville trying to play Nancy Drew. I'm going to ride up there and see what's up with Greg. Not without me, you're not. I'm the one who told you Greg was there. And if John McBain is asking questions about him, that means trouble. Greg needs help from both of us. Why Dr. Evans said what he did on the stand? And neither does Destiny. I mean, why? Why would he swear under oath that my mom wanted me to be with Ross when I know that it's not true? I don't, maybe... Maybe he misunderstood, or maybe Taya was so sick. No, she, no, of... she wasn't. She wasn't confused. Okay, she asked for me and our dad. She was asking for what she wanted, for me to be with Todd. I bet she's really esteemed now. I know she is. You know, maybe uh, she'll perform a miracle or something. What, like from beyond the grave? Yeah, maybe she'll make it so that you can stay. Todd? Taya? Taya? Is that you? You remember that dive at the end of the boardwalk? Hands in the bushes, hands in the bushes, oh. throttle on the bottle, throb of the knob, and away we go! Woo! <laughs> oh, hey, honey, there you are. Um, this is my wife, Vicki Banks. Vicki, this is an old pal. Echo de Savoy. Hello, Vicki. Yes. I need to deal with Greg without worrying about you. Deal with? Are you going to do what I told you or not? What do you mean you're going to deal with our brother? It means I'm going to handle it. 
alone because I don't know what I'm going to find in Cherryville. Yeah. Taya? Who was Taya? No, Todd. Taya is dead. How did you get your hands on my cell phone? Why can't I talk to my husband? Because at this clinic, we followed doctor's orders, Mrs. Manning. And Dr. Evans said, absolutely no phone calls. Greg is my brother, too. Besides, I was onto something way before you were. No, you weren't. I was all over him at the hospice the night Taya died. I knew then he was hiding something. No signs of Clark. What the hell happened? Get help. I barely got a pulse. So what if he knew Greg was into something before I did? I'm still going with you. Tom, out. Look, sweetness, I know you're hurting, but don't take it out on your brother. Take what out? I heard the news about Danny. Your BFF's leaving? Don't worry. I'm here to help you make it through the night. That's why you want to go to Cherryville so bad. Danny's leaving. You don't want her to go. You don't know what to do with that. Get my mom performing a miracle from beyond the grave. Right now, I'd be happy if Nate just showed up to say goodbye. Yeah, I'm surprised that Nate isn't here yet. Hey, is something going on? Well, I didn't want to say anything downstairs with your mom right there. It was weird. After the custody hearing, Nate told me that he was going to fix things. What did he mean? I have no idea. And then he just took off. No visitors allowed. I'm not a visitor. I'm Danny's boyfriend. We can't risk someone keeping her from leaving with her father. Well, isn't there some kind of guest list or something? This isn't some nightclub. You can't get in. <sighs> I'm sure that you will talk to Nate before Ross gets back. Maybe we should just go back to that miracle idea. <laughs> Maybe something will happen that will stop me from having to leave with Ross. Where's the... It's the window! What? <gasps> the hell with that! My, my girlfriend's about to leave the country. I'm going to say goodbye to her. What are you doing here? How did you even know that I was yeah, here? Wait. You said that you couldn't even be my friend. And you're, you're really starting to freak me I'm out. I'm not here for you, Star, okay? I'm here for Danny. You two know each other? Echo, I think Joanne told you that I have absolutely no time to see you tonight. I understand that this is vitally important. Nothing you say to me could be at all important. Unless you want to tell me you're leaving town, that would be very welcome. Could we just go into your office for a moment? I am quite prepared to have security come in here and haul you out of the building if it comes to that. Are you afraid of what you might find out, Vicky? I'm not afraid of you. And I'm not interested in anything you have to say to me. You have lied continuously and I don't trust you at all. Vicky and I go way back. I knew Vicky way before I ever met you, Chuckles. Really? Mm. Where? Oh, here. We met right here in Landview. Uh. Echo slept with my husband. Nate told me everything that's going on with Danny. The whole custody thing, how they're going to be taking you back to Tahiti, and, and he begged me to help. So I figured, what's a brother for, right? Wait, okay, where's Nate? He, he's downstairs. He's pulling a fast one on Landview's finest. Knock it off, kid, or I'll haul you in. Dude, I'm not a criminal, okay? I just don't know when I'm ever going to see my girlfriend again. Mr. Manning! Mrs. Kramer! It, it's Nate! Yeah, called me. God, I'm sorry, but that's impossible. Mrs. Kramer, it, it's Nate! Please, Mrs. Kramer, you have to help me. I need to see Danny, and these cops won't let me. Officers, please. This girl is about to be ripped away from people that she loves, and one of them is right here. It's our job, ma'am. I know that it is, but he is not going to keep Danny away from Ross, all right? He just wants to say goodbye to Danny. Okay, okay, but we're going with him. I can't believe you're doing this for Nate. For us. I know what my brother's going through. 
two people are supposed to be together, and you do what it takes to make it happen. I I know, Greg. He he he, he wouldn't mind if I talk to my husband. Dr. Okay. Evans was very specific about not letting you make calls. He thought it would upset you, and he was right. Well, well, I wouldn't be upset if you hadn't snatched the phone away. I'm sorry. I have to follow his orders. I don't understand. Why is Greg doing this to me? Do you know how long he's been down? He stopped breathing. We're losing him. I think you're more upset about Danny than you're letting on. This whole mess upsets me, especially Greg's part in it. We don't know all the facts yet. We know that Greg lied on the stand about what Taya's dying wish was. He knew what would happen. Why would he do something like that? That's what I'm going down there to find out. Darren thinks Greg might have gotten hooked on drugs. That the stress from Taya dying in his care might have made him snap or something. Do you think he's right? Destiny. Baby girl, let your brother do his thing. That's what he gets paid the big bucks for. And if something is going down in Cherryvale, he'll handle it. That's right. And we can find out what flight Danny's on and say goodbye to her at the airport. I know what you're doing, Darren. But, okay. You'll let me know what's up with Greg, right? The second I do. I promise. Get some dessert on me. Darren, you don't have to do that. I want to. Cheer up, little D. Okay? Who knows? Maybe I'll find something out in Cherryville that changes things for Danny. Listen to me. Why isn't my husband, why, why isn't Todd coming for me? Mrs. Tell Manning, me. Manning, I can't. Mrs. Manning. Please, please help me. Please help me. Is that Todd? Is he calling me back? You need to rest. Wait, I'll please. To check wait, you. please. Yes, who is this? I just got a call from this phone. I'm sorry, I must have dialed the wrong number. No, 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 it wasn't you. It, it... Someone said my name. It sounded like my wife. This is my phone. I'm sorry for the mix-up. 